Off topic, students were everywhere around Miss Clever's classroom one day, as I came to observe. They were presenting their topics to a partner to practice before they presented to the class. The class was a little chaotic, but the students were all working hard on their projects. Miss Clever was walking around the classroom, asking different students questions, so I followed along behind her. She thought creating projects about the lesson they were learning would help the students learn in class. She was very dramatic and loved to act out parts of history in front of the children. I always enjoyed seeing what her class was working on each day. Miss Clever had just finished listening to one student who I knew was her teacher's helper, Lou Tennant. As soon as they finished, Lou picked up a clipboard and followed Miss Clever to the next group. I wondered what they were going to do, so I followed as well. As we listened, I heard one of the students talk about her project. During the time of President Lincoln, there were many who did not agree with him. Miss Clever directed Lou to write down the main idea of the student's project. Lou asked, Was the main idea President of the United States? Miss Clever replied, No. She was only talking about President Lincoln. They continued on to the next group, and this time the student presented, There are many famous locations around the world, but one important one is the Eiffel Tower in Paris. Lou looked to Miss Clever and asked, Is the main idea famous locations around the world? Miss Clever thought and answered, No. They are only talking about the Eiffel Tower in Paris. They walked over to the next group and listened as a student said, Christopher Columbus was a famous explorer. He had a very famous life. Lou seemed to be catching on because this time he said excitedly, Oh, the main idea this time is about Christopher Columbus, who is a famous explorer. Miss Clever smiled and responded, That is correct, Lou. They continued on, but it was time for me to go to another class. I was sure that their projects were a success and full of information. From just the little that I had heard, they were covering a lot of history in a small amount of time. Main Idea Lesson In life, we listen to what others say and we try to find the main idea of the conversation. Most of the time, we do that without even realizing it. If your friend was talking to you about getting a dog, then they may mention all the types of dogs that they looked at. They may say that they wanted a golden retriever because they believe it is the best, since they are known for being gentle. You may have realized that you were talking about the best type of dog for your friend. There are many times that the students have to figure out the main idea in the lesson in this chapter. One example is when Lou realizes that the student said that Christopher Columbus was a famous explorer. Lou said, Oh, the main idea this time is about Christopher Columbus, who is a famous explorer. He had a very famous life. He noticed that the other student was talking only about Christopher Columbus and not all explorers. See if you can find some other examples of main ideas.